Okay, well, now that I have my morning coffee right here, mmm, 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 sorry, I'm ready to give you an update on the Mons. As you can see, uh, Gomamon digivolved into Ikakumon. Yes, he is a beautiful looking walrus with a horn on his head. Uh, I am the walrus, Cuckoo Kachu. Look at those teeth. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. The other day was John Lennon's birthday, so I have the Beatles on my mind or something. And uh, he is, in fact, a walrus Digimon, as you can see. But, um, also, the wind egg that we opened gave us Biomon, who is a bird. Big surprise there. And, uh, speaking of John Lennon, her, uh, oh, wait. Her, um, in-training form is actually called... Yoko... Yokomon, like Yoko Ono. Yokomon. Yeah, I, I skipped past the baby and that's the baby. I think that's Piyokomon, like Piyokomon. The baby and in training stages of Biomon. But there it is, Yokomon. This is a very interesting themes video. Like I said, John Lennon's birthday, a few days after mine. That's all right. And um, it just seems to work out that way. So we've got a walrus and a bird on the blue Digivice. And on the black one, whoop, we still have Tentamon, but he's got a little friend. Who's the little friend, you might ask? It is actually a Copymon. I put in a code for this Copymon. It's actually Stingmon from Adventure 02, who Digivolves from Wormmon. You can't get Wormmon on these devices, but you can put in a code and get Stingmon for reasons. There's actually no good reason to have Stingmon on this particular device, because I can't get a certain Digimon who he can Jogress with on here, but if I do it on that one, I will eventually get the Jogress Digimon for him. No spoilers. I, you probably already know who I'm talking about, of course, um, if you're a fan of Digimon and watch the show. Plus, the Nightmare Soldier's Egg, or, or, or I'm sorry, Demi Miramon Digivolved into Tapirmon, who also has a little partner with him, and who is that, you might ask? The Copymon that I actually copied from one of my devices, uh, one of my version 20th devices, that is, is Seedramon, because he is a data champion, and we're going to need a data champion for what I have in store for Tapirmon. Tapirmon's a pretty cool-looking rookie. He's like a little anteater ghost thing. I don't know. <laughs> um, but I'm, I have plans. On So far, I've taken care of all of these Digimon perfectly to get them into their, like, canonical forms. Like, I'm going to did you both Biomon to Bergermon probably because that satisfies me. I want to get the ultimate form of Bergermon because that Digimon is my f like pretty much my favorite Digimon. So I can't wait. <clears throat> I'm also going to Digivolve Ikakumon into his ultimate form by doing battles. Maybe I'll do a battle real quick. Let's do a battle. Well, wait, well let me finish explaining. But yeah, so I need a data champion to Jogress with him when he reaches champion, and it's going to be a very cool champion indeed. So let's battle with Ikakumon. So in order to battle, you have to make use of the pendulum uh, function on this device. I believe that is Gesomon. Oh, let's put the sound on. I want to have sound effects for this. There we go. I believe that's Gesomon. It's another one of the deep savers. All right, so I got to shake real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. So there you go. That is a legit harpoon torpedo right there. Harpoon torpedo. Oh no, that's a claw move. Harpoon torpedo is the first one, I believe, because it looks more like a horn. Oh, poor Ikakumon. There we go. Harpoon torpedo! This is fitting. It's two aquatic Digimon versus each other. I think, and I also did a f quite a few battles with him already. So I think that is actually the last battle I needed to meet his requirements for Digivolution. Let's see. Wait, oh, there we go. Yeah, 15 out of 17. I lost two battles with him at one point, but uh, I won 15 out of the last... Wait, I won 12 out of the last 15, actually. I only needed to win 12. So yeah, he'll be good. He'll be good to Digivolve when he's ready. I gotta wait like, you know, 24 hours or 36 hours.
but I think he's been Ikakuman since the middle of the night last night, so that's good. But yeah, and then these guys, uh, yeah, I'm going to Digivolve Tentamon, Dekabuterimon, he's probably almost there, just a little longer, and then uh, Tapirmon will Digivolve to someone who will be maybe a surprise, I don't know. Also, on the Digimon 20th, uh, I actually got a few cool Digimons. I got Monzemon, who took a crap on the screen. Let me clean that up. Monzemon is a creepy teddy bear who does, in fact, shoot hearts of magic. He's like a Care Bear. Look at that. So adorable. Yeah. And then on this one, I finally got the last two super ultimates that I needed, which are Examon and Grace Novamon. So yeah, because I Jogressed, um, well, I Jogressed, who was it, Break Dramon and Wing Dramon to get him, and Dianamon and Apollomon to get him or her. Or, I only gendered the Digimons according to, I don't know, they weren't in the show, so I don't know their characters, but... I have been gendering the Digimon according to what they were in the show. Otherwise, Digimon don't have genders. Actually, in Season 3, Tamers, Renamon actually says, Digimon don't have genders. We just can come across as a certain way. So, like, even Renamon isn't a she. But I'm kind of going with how they were in the show because that's half the reason I enjoy these devices, is the nostalgia from the show. But anyway, we'll see what these all Digivolve into next time. And I check in with you. Peace.